Hello everyone, in this video we're going to be talking about how we can use Google key Google's Keyword Planner along with Amazon subcategories to kind of come up with our own um, to create a bunch of related keywords to these subcategories that could possibly spark some ideas um, and or um, possibly find some ca find some possible products for us to sell just by looking at the keywords that the subcategories bring up. So. Um, what we're going to be using today is Google's Keyword Planner along with Amazon's bestseller list and category. So that's how the, two, two, the two tools we're going to be using in this video. It's going to be a quick little short video of showing you guys how I use this method to come up with possible product ideas for to sell on Amazon. So let's just get right into it. First thing we're going to do is go over to Amazon's bestsellers list. Um, you have seen this me talk about this area before. And we're going to be doing a little things a little bit different here though. What we're going to do first is come down here and click on any of the departments that you want to possibly sell in or come up with ideas in. So let's go to um, sports and outdoors. And then from there, actually I really don't. Let's go one more category in. So all right, so sports, sports and outdoors, sports and fitness, and then see all of these categories, subcategories, with underneath the sports and fitness overall category such as boating and sailing, exercise and fitness, golf, hunting, fishing, blah blah blah. You can see all these keywords right here. Actually, I'll, let's mark this. All of these um, subcategories right here on Amazon. These are the ones that we want to uh, put into Google's Keyword Planner. So we're going to go one by one. First thing we're going to do is boating and sailing. So let's come over here, search new keyword, right here boating but instead of boating and sailing I'm just gonna do comma sailing okay come down here get ideas and this is gonna bring up a page first we can go add group ideas this is the first one we're gonna do and scroll down and look at all of the ad groups so small boat boat trader cheap boat sailboat sail sailing lessons so a lot of these aren't really things that we could sell um, boat trailers, boat kits, rowboat. I mean, so you guys can also look at the keywords right here that come up along with it. This probably isn't the best example, boating and sailing, because not a lot of products we're going to be selling in private labeling from China are going to be related to boating and sailing, but you still kind of get the whole process that I go through. So first thing you do is look at the ad group ideas right here on this tab. Look at the ad groups as, long as, the key as well as the keywords. If you want, you can click on here to get a little more detailed look at the keywords. Um, but you can do that. Another thing you do is click on the keyword ideas tab. This is going to bring up a bunch of different keywords related to your search terms. Um, you can just scroll through here and find something that could, um, like sailing gear could be something that we could think about searching more for. Um, salvage boats. Let's just go to the next one. So you can just search through here, click the next one, and just keep looking through here to kind of boat accessories. Um, just um, sort of just jog your um, thought process and try to think of some new ideas just by looking at all these keywords related to a certain search term. Um, one thing you can do is download this into an Excel document and kind of sort it by different metrics if you wanted to. I'm not going to get that um, deep into this, but if you wanted to do that, you could. So let's go back to, let's just say we found, where was that? S sailing gear. Okay, so say we found this. Obviously, we're not going to be making sailing gear exactly, but this could give us a kind of a seed keyword that we could put into Amazon that could give us more ideas. Or we could actually put this into Google search, Google Keyword Planner as well if we wanted to. Let's just try both just for this video. So I'm just kind of winging it here. I wasn't planning on doing this, but I think it, I think this could be a good idea. So let's find a kind of a category within the sailing niche of the sailing ge of sailing gear. So copy this, come back over to Amazon. Let's search sailing gear and just see what comes up so premium gloves waterproof duffel bags could be something we could think about so not a lot of stuff came up but let's just put it in here in the Google keyword planner and see what pops up okay so um, sailing shoes, sailing gloves, right here, sail sailing gloves. That's just, that's just a perfect idea. 
sailing gloves. Look at this. We could get sailing gloves um, outsourced to China and made in China, and we could sell our own brand of sailing gloves if we wanted to. So that's a good idea. Let's see what else com comes up. Um, rain suits might be something, but probably not. Sailing boots. Let's just keep looking to see if we find anything else. Sailing hats. Sailing hats. Let's just see what that could bring us. Ceiling hat. So I mean, this is kind of generic, like looking bucket hat kind of thing. So probably want to stay away from that. But let's just keep looking, really quick. Try to find at least one more example for you guys. Um, sailing watches. No. Uh, let's see, I'm not seeing anything else, but you guys kind of get the overall idea of how you can go about this. Um, fishing rain gear, like you could, I mean, this kind of is like a, it can lead you from one thing to another. So we search sailing gear, we could search for uh, fishing rain gear up here, which would bring us a whole bunch of more related keywords that we that we could possibly look through. So best rain gear for fishing. So just a bunch bicycle rain gear. Just a bunch of just a different way to go about the keyword research process to bring up um, some possible product ideas that we could sell on Amazon. So you guys will probably get the overall process that we go through here. Just kind of go back and forth from Amazon, from Keyword Planner, um, put in different keywords up here, um, search, find something, put it in here, see what comes up. You can a good place to start obviously is to start by searching a category or sub, a subcategory within Amazon into Google Keyword Planner and then from there doing what I just did as I get dig deeper deeper in, into the niche. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just a quick little video and show you guys how I use Google's Keyword Planner along with Amazon to come up with some to generate some cool product ideas. So hope you guys enjoyed that and um, I'll see you guys in the next video.